these animals become more than just a sheep or more than just a calf. They become something that we care about, that we work for, that they become part of our life. My name is Brett Selman, a uh, longtime rancher and uh, farmer here in northern Utah. We live uh, in Box Elder County in Tree Mountain. So we have a farm and a cattle operation also. This is a family operation. I've got my two sons with me today. My two daughters aren't here today, but they'll be the fourth generation ranchers here in from what my grandpa started in the 50s. My wife is a very much part of this sheep operation. She feeds us, she takes care of us, she does the vaccinating uh, on docking days and, and, and shearing, she's right there with us. Uh, I think of working with my kids, I get the chance to listen to their ideas and to try to implement their ideas into our operation and I think that's extremely valuable. What do you think, Wyatt? What's our, what's our future in this operation? Well, I think, uh, just like Cole said, it's not really just a job or a career, it's a, it's a lifestyle. And uh, you've taught us how to work hard and how to have 16, 18 hour days and go without sleep. And it's the <laughs> same kind of thing that I want my kids to, to know how to do is how to work and, and, re, and gain a respect for the range and for, for agriculture. So you want to punish your children the same way I punish you? I got a little revenge, yeah. <laughs> That's good to know. <laughs> Some of the values that, that I've learned from my dad and grandpa and my family has been, you know, the value of hard work, the value of endurance, being able to stay with the job until it's done. Even if times are hard and it may not pay, there's always next year. One of the things we try to do is we try to take Sundays off and spend some time worshiping and thanking the powers that be for the chance to be here on the ranch and the chance to, to work on the ground and to work with the livestock and to work with the wildlife. We try to be grateful for a rainstorm or a, an easy winter. This is our future in uh, sheep industry. This is a ewe lamb. I can tell her right off because we've marked her with a, a, a different earmark from the other lambs. Uh, this. If this, if this ewe lamb was to be depredated by a lion or a bear, then uh, that future for her and for us through her is gone. So uh, the, these, these animals become more than just a sheep or more than just a calf. They become something that we care about, that we work for that they become part of our life. I mean, I, she doesn't have a name, but, but she's one of our ewes and, and, we, and we get proud of her. And she'll, she'll be here for many years to come, raising lambs just like her, as long as we can keep her alive and keep ourselves working to, to make this ranch work. Mm -hmm.